Joining us now is Joshua Cordicus. He's a billing supervisor for West Bloomfield Water Utilities Division at Town Hall. To talk with us about his position, Joshua, thanks so much for joining us this morning. Oh, hello, thank you very much. Joshua, could you first start off by telling us a little bit about your position as a billing supervisor at Town Hall? So yeah, I oversee four billing analysts, um, and then I handle any escalations, uh, such as uh, issues with high bills, uh, customers that experience leaks, uh, customers that need uh, assistance above and beyond what a billing analyst uh, can provide, uh, and uh, really everything in between. Joshua, now let's dive into the Water Utilities Division. Can you tell us a little bit about what your department oversees in the township at Town Hall? Yeah, we oversee about roughly 21,000 accounts in the township uh, and handle uh, billing uh, and maintaining records in regards to billing uh, consumptions from all of our water meters within the township. So uh, we know how much water has been used. Uh, we can account for um, you know, leaks that may have been occurring, all that stuff there. Really basically anything billing related, we handle. Joshua, let's talk now about some of those things that you oversee in the township for the West Bloomfield residents that have maybe some questions um, about what your department oversees for those water rates in the West Bloomfield Township. Uh, could you tell us a little bit about how one can figure out what their water rate is as well as giving us some details about that? So yeah, every bill that we mail out quarterly um, has our water rates listed on it. Um, depending on the services that each property gets, some customers are just connected to water, some are just connected to sewer, uh, some are connected to both. Uh, and those rates are listed on the bill uh, right on the front of it so that it, it goes down to explain how much it costs uh, per CCF, which is what we bill in. Uh, and uh, basically, if they ever have any questions though with rates in regards to how they're uh, assessed and whatnot, those are typically done by the board. Uh, board votes on rates, those pass along to us once a year some years we don't get rate increases, some years we do. Uh, it just depends on what percentage rate increase is approved by the township board. And Joshua, for the billing process uh, here in West Bloomfield Township, could you tell us a little bit about, you talked about uh, the bills that get sent out quarterly. Could you tell, tell us a little bit about the process of billing? Sure, yeah, we bill quarterly, like I said, uh, every three months. Um, the bills have a due date to assigned to them. That due date can vary between one or two days um, from year to year. Uh, it just depends. It's uh, always gonna be on the second to last business day of every month. Um, and uh, we do offer a auto pay option where you can set your account up for automatic quarterly withdrawal. Uh, you can set it up with a credit card, debit card, checking account. Uh, however, I can caution people that if you do set it up with a credit or debit card, they do charge an additional 3% uh, with a minimum of $2 assessed when you're doing credit debit card checking accounts. There is no additional fees for those. So most people do choose to set up their auto, automatic quarterly payments with checking accounts because of that. Uh, we also offer paperless billing where you can set your account up so you'll just get an email with your bill. Uh, we have noticed recently postal service is not all that reliable in our area, it would it seem. Uh, the delivery times are getting extended uh, for whatever reason on their end. So uh, a lot of people have chosen to go with paperless billing uh, so that they just get an email with their bill uh, instead of relying on the postal service to deliver it. Joshua, with those bills, you also probably have a lot of residents who uh, are, make their payment a little bit later and get those late fees for their water bill. Can you talk to us a little about those late fees and what a resident in West Bloomfield can do if they have one of those late fees? So our late fees are written into our township ordinance. It's a 7% uh, late fee based on the balance of the account that exists uh, after the due date. So. Um, Basically, if you get assessed a late penalty, um, you can you have two options. You can either pay it right then and there after the uh, the due date, or uh, you can pay it with your next quarterly bill. Uh, it would just be added to the next quarterly bill uh, as a prior balance, and, uh, and you can pay it with that bill. 
Joshua, as we wrap up here, is there anything else you wanted to share with our audience about the Water Utilities Division or your um, position as the billing supervisor there at Town Hall? Uh, yeah, it, all, all of our auto pay, paperless, all those options are available at the Township's website, www.wbtownship.org. Uh, and they just click on the payments link and that'll get them set up for, you know, get them toward the uh, auto pay so they can get it set up. If they ever have any questions, they can always reach out to us. Our uh, billing staff can assist them at 248-451-4832. That's our main billing number. Um, and we can help them out with any questions they may have. Awesome, well, thank you so much for joining us, Joshua. We appreciate it. Yeah, thank you very much for having me, I appreciate it.